Happy Wednesday! Uh, today I just uh, I got to Starbucks and I've been seeing on TikTok again, still obsessed. I don't know how long this obsession is gonna go for. And I always see these drink recreations and I've always wanted to try them, but this one like really caught my eye because I love Vietnamese coffee. Wow, she's ready. I'm gonna recreate a Vietnamese coffee. Okay, can I get a grande triple shot espresso, splash ice. of heavy cream, two pumps of white mocha over ice? Oh, ice. <laughs> yes. All right, anyways, as I was saying, that is what I'm doing today. And I'm gonna try it because I make Vietnamese coffee where at my aunt's restaurant, so I know how I like it. I'm gonna drink it on the way to school because I'm running a little late. I thought I would leave in time to, uh, to sit and, you know, enjoy my coffee and live my life, but I'm not. And I still look like a hobo today. So, I don't know. I was doing homework this morning and I got carried away, I guess. Okay. Didn't I say grande? This is definitely not grande. That's what you have to order. Let's try it. Thank you so much. <laughs> it's actually pretty good, not gonna lie. Very strong. I'm going to be way off the walls today. So whoever has to see me today, I'm sorry. Triple espresso. I've never even gotten one of those before. To be honest, I didn't really need coffee this morning. I had a good eight hours of sleep. Dude, I kind of love this. The only thing that's different. Ooh, I just say it. Don't spray it, Allison. My camera's exposure is like, I don't know. It's off. This video is just not going the way I wanted it to. About this coffee. Yeah, it's good. But the only thing is like, I just don't feel Asian drinking it, you know what I mean? But it's okay because, I mean, I don't feel Asian drinking it because it's from Starbucks and like, they don't specialize in this. And the thing about Vietnamese coffee, it's slow drip. So whenever you make it, it's like very, I don't know, the flavor's just there, every drop. And there's condensed milk and evaporated milk, which this has heavy cream and... Heavy cream and what? Hi, that's awkward. <laughs> he just, okay. Heavy cream and white mocha instead of condensed milk and evaporated milk. But other than that, I would give this a score of probably six, six and a half. That's the best that Starbucks can do and it does taste like the coffee, but not entirely. Whenever I am stranded and I'm really craving a Vietnamese coffee, I know how to order it. And y'all can try it too because a lot of y'all probably haven't even tried Vietnamese coffee, but this will give you a little insight into what it tastes like. So that is it. Video was very short. I know. I'm sorry. Uh, I mean, we could go and talk about things while I eat my feta cheese wrap. I don't even know what I got. I'm just hungry, and I'm really not on Whole30 anymore. I'm sorry, mom. Oh wow. There's nothing special going on. I literally only go to school for two periods. I'm carrying on this video, and I really don't need to. I'm just gonna drink my coffee and go crazy. Go stupid. Well, that is all. Y'all should go try this Vietnamese coffee too. I do recommend it. I do recommend it. But I wouldn't recommend it over the original, authentic Vietnamese coffee. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you guys liked it. I'm gonna pay attention to the road and I'm gonna try to do my outro without looking at the camera. So, don't forget to like, subscribe, and get notified.